Scorpios. Send me like, like, thank you to everyone that's liked, shared, or subscribed. If you guys have purchased a reading or if you've donated to my page, I appreciate you. This energy can be masculine or feminine, so you place it wherever you need to, okay? Just let it fall, spirit. Thank you. So you have someone around you that's been elusive, or this could be you. They feel like you're their ace, though, okay? You could have known this person for quite some time, or maybe this person has children, or you have a child with this person, okay? This person made you feel unlovable. This person is in your energy right now. Okay, they may miss making love to you. This is lusty, or they could be sending you sexual energy. This person is disillusioned, right? Meaning they're not seeing things the way that they need to right now. Or their arrogance could be causing them not to. That's what I'm feeling. All right, they could have been very cold to you, or they feel like you like an ice queen mold. Okay, this person could be sending you music. This person could be a musician. They could like to listen to songs or write songs or sing songs. Okay, somebody here is stressed, someone's obsessed, and someone's receiving their karma, bottom of the deck, intimacy, desire, intimacy, sexual thoughts, sexual dreams, arousal. Okay, so someone's thinking about you. Let's see what signs this could be. Okay, we have someone that could be a Libra. This could be you. We have a Gemini here. We have a Sagittarius, and we have an Aries. We'll take it how it resonates for you, okay? Okay, we have the Eight of Inspiration. Inspiration in this deck is Eight of Wands. Okay. So with this Eight of Wands energy, someone can have Sagittarius in the chart. They want to move fast. They want to be hasty. They want to rush in. They may want to see you or come in around the holiday for a love affair. Okay. They're obsessed about it. They want to connect. Okay. This is someone that may have to travel towards you or may be wanting to travel towards you. You have Six of Voices, Six of Swords. Okay, this is an Aquarius energy, mental healing, calmer waters. This is someone that is trying to get through or has went through and done the work, but you may still be holding on to a little bit of negativity. Okay, you made progress, you're moving on, but you're still in that negative energy. Give me one more. Give me one more. Thank you, Spirit. I have seven of inspiration, which in this deck, inspiration is wands. Seven of wands could be Leo energy someone's going through challenges or will pressure needing to stand up for yourself needing to take the high road though wanting to maintain control of a situation place or a person or fighting for what you want someone is trying to do that and someone if this is not you this is that person bottom of the deck you're needing to balance your energy with uh the sagittarius energy here balance masculine and feminine energy okay harmony Okay, growth, abundance, and expansion, all that good stuff that you uh, can bring in with this temperance card. Someone's needing to understand that. Good chemistry, patience with yourself, but aligning to your purpose and to the universe, okay? Going in for inner peace and understanding that you're, that you're protected, okay? That's what it is, okay? Someone wants to work to fix something with you, but you're healing yourself to allow a higher vibration. I don't know if this person is right for you. Just stay on your your uh, spiritual path, guys. And use your discernment. I'm sending you guys love and light. Y'all take care.